Hi everyone, Company Dogtana here, the internet's busiest Nerf meme tuber, and today is the first episode of Coney Dog Vlogs. Today we're going to be talking about... It is currently 11 a.m. Thursday, June 23rd. One day before, we are going to Jeb. So, this is the start of that. So, first thing on the to-do list is we have to go and run some errands, go grab some supplies, because... This will be my first road trip that I'm doing completely by myself. Uh, I am going to be meeting some people there. Part of Crush Gang will be there. I mean, we got we got Dr. Flux. He's going to be a Doom guy. Um, Alex is probably going to be there too. I'm going to text him tomorrow morning and see if he's still going. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. I also get to hopefully meet the infamous Coop. Yeah. <laughs> so this is gonna be a little bit outside of my comfort zone. I'm not really used to doing videos that don't have as much editing, but I mean, it's a first for everything. I'll probably still have some stupid edits here and there, but it's whatever. I probably won't do more of these. This will probably be like the only one, but if I if I do more, then if it you know gets somewhere, then I'll just keep doing them. Why not? I just got done at Sam's Club. Um, surprisingly busy for it being like almost 12 on a Thursday, but it, it's whatever. I think I'm gonna stop at uh, Casey's and get some of that 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 bus and new Mountain Dew. It's called Overdrive. It's actually pretty good. Um, it's like called Citrus Punch, but I think it's more of like a blood orange flavor. It's very tasty. Very tasty. I love I love blood orange anyway. So. I'm a sucker for blood orange. So I'm leaving Casey's now. I actually snagged the two new Baja Blast flavors. They're uh, both pretty good, actually. Um, I was worried that usually with new Baja Blast, or not Baja Blast, but Mountain Dew flavors in general, they're usually like too sweet. Um, these new ones, thankfully, they're not too sweet. I mean, they're still pretty sweet because it's Mountain Dew, but um, yeah, not too bad. I'm kind of impressed, actually. Yo. All done Walmart, so I just gotta hit him with the Casey Neistat wave. I like how it's like 80 degrees outside, but it's like also kind of starting to rain. It's like super, super humid. That's what sucks about living in the Midwest. It's just the humidity is just, ugh. It's not as bad as like um, the East Coast, like Florida, South Carolina, all done. That, it gets pretty bad there. But here in the Midwest, oof. Oof. Okay, so like literally 30 seconds have passed since the last segment I made in. It's just coming down pretty good now. Um, it's a good thing I didn't wash my car today. Now hopefully it just washes away all the bird shit that's on my window. It is currently 12.50 in the morning. I have to get up in six hours to take the car to the shop so that an emergency repair can be done. All right, so it is 10.24 on Friday, the day before the event. Uh, car has been serviced and everything should be fine. We'll see when I get back if it's if it's a problem, but yep, it's gonna be about a 10 hour drive. So first road trip by myself, excited, a little bit nervous, but it, it, it is what it is. Hopefully uh, we'll make it there. <laughs> tastes like sugar-free cotton candy, so low-key kind of tastes pretty, pretty mid to kind of shit. Okay, so I'm making a quick stop at this gas station. They have some like really good sausage beef sticks. I don't know. Uh, I'll let you know if I find them. Oh, Fanny! Oh! 
People right next to me just gave me a really weird look. <laughs> So we're about three hours in. Uh, I missed a turn at a toll booth and had to pay a toll. And, like, <laughs> delayed myself by like 20 minutes. I think I shaved a little bit off that time, but we're, we're gonna make it. I already cracked open my uh, second energy drink. <sighs> Which tastes way better than a ninja crap. So a minor update, uh, I stopped to get some gas. I changed my sunglasses because uh, the damn screw fell out of my favorite sunglasses. And I just fixed them like literally two days ago. So that's awesome. So now I have to find another uh, sunglasses repair kit somewhere. The screw is somewhere, heaven knows where at that rest stop, you know. And these, these shades are pretty cool too, but these are not my favorites. Even though they're, whatever. But yeah, so we have about, what time is it? About six hours left. Let's go. Oh, we're not in Kansas anymore. <laughs> we're about two and a half hours out. Uh, just thought I'd give a quick update because a lot of time has passed since the last one. Uh, traffic, slowdowns, probably an accident, I don't know. But yeah, I've kind of just been in this traffic loop for like 20 minutes. And uh, I was making good time up until this happened, so. So we just got to the big T. Um, yeah, yeah! So I made it to Arlington. Um, I'm staying with Flux in his hotel room. Excellent view of the stadium. Just look at that. That's just, I mean, it, it, it's a little reflective, but it's fine. Like there's even, there's a little pool down there. It's so cool. But yeah, got the BFG right here. But no, it's just like the, the the people of Texas. I don't I don't know what it is, but like everybody drives like they listen to thrash era Metallica. Everybody drives like ten miles per hour over the speed limit. Seems like people don't really follow like directional laws either. So. All right, so me and Flux are going into Walmart right now. We need some aloe vera because <laughs> somebody got a sunburn. I need a belt because my stupid ass didn't pack one. And yeah, general supplies. We're gonna get some Mickey D's for breakfast. I'm gonna laugh if I get a higher score than you. My score was 190. Oh, come on, come on. <laughs> nah, you got this, you got this. <laughs> you gotta commit. That's not committing. You gotta commit. <laughs> like that. <laughs> really weird being in the stadium before there's like you know thousands of people that are coming in but yeah it's pretty cool pretty cool <sighs> absolute insanity absolute insanity we'll talk more about it when I get back to the uh, hotel. Just played through two games. I don't have any footage because my dumb ass didn't bring my GoPro, but I went hard. <laughs> and the entire time, I was just using just the fate. Single shot. About to say hi to the boys. Oh. 
I'm dying. All right, so we just got out of Jeb. We got out of AT&T Stadium. We actually got locked inside. We had to be escorted out of the tunnel that uh, we had trucks go into. It was very exhausting. I'm in so much pain. I can't. Look, it's just, he's fucking done. He was in that fucking suit the entire time. And I helped him get autographs and um, pictures taken. He had to keep taking his mask off, and every time I would hold it, it's just just pools of sweat. <laughs> it was like sticking my hand inside of like like a cookie jar, and the cookies were just placed in there after they pulled out the oven, and then the condensation just on the outside of the cookie jar. Poor kids. <laughs> it is currently twelve oh three in the morning. We are exhausted, but we're gonna go have a treat with the boys. So. Yeah, let's, let's do it! It is currently seven in the morning, the day after the event. Um, we were up pretty late last night. We were drinking, we drank a lot, I drank a lot. We had a lot of fun. Um, I'm gonna go to the pool take a quick swim before I get ready for the day. Okay, just kidding, the pool isn't open until 8. So I'm going to enjoy this parfait and I'll go back down in an hour. It is 9.24. I went swimming for a little bit, just kind of like to, to chill out, relax. Um, we're just waiting, killing time now until we have to go to the airport. I'm gonna drop uh, Flux, Xavier, and who else? Who else am I dropping off at the airport? Welcome. And welcome. And drop them off at the airport. Probably not gonna do another segment until I get out of Texas, because crazy drivers out there. Like, literally, it was like, just insanity coming here. I thought maybe that I would be, um, not recording anything until after I got out of Texas, but it's not true. Uh, I got a little hungry, so I stopped at Jack in the Box. I'm gonna have Jack in the Box where I live, so. I've had it once before. Thought I was pretty good. I'll try it again. Try something different and see if I still like it. Mm. <laughs> Nothing too exciting though. Um, saw these tiny tacos. It's like a, I don't know. Yeah, it's like a well, like a taquito. It'll probably be better with that. Cheers. It does make a difference. Um, yeah, pretty good. Um, like I said, we don't have anything like this where I live, so it's nice to have a change of pace. It's not too exciting, but it's still good. Probably gonna give me heartburn later. Also, I realized how much my ass is sore. My ass is so sore right now. It, it, uh, I am in so much pain. I'm just, yesterday was just, just crazy. But yeah, we're gonna get back on the road shortly. I'll see you in a little bit. I think we're, we're still in Texas, but yeah, so just uh, kind of just rattling off some thoughts about my trip. Um, it was pretty stressful. Uh, there was a lot going on. Um, as I said before, like I, I did spend most of the event just basically holding Luke's helmet, or Dr. Flux rather, his helmet most of the time uh, when he was doing signatures and whatnot. Um, I got shot a lot. Um, probably more than I think I deserved. I think people were probably trying to shoot at somebody else and hitting me instead, which, which is fine. But like some people had like a hyper stinks. It's, it's rough. Um, and like people are like using like strikers, which it's just like, at, at those kind of events, those blasters, it just doesn't make sense to have them because like they're using half length darts and half length darts are expensive, so why would you bring expensive ammo to the event? You know, even hyper, like, it just doesn't, I don't know, it just seems like a waste to me. But, yeah, so, uh, lots of stuff going on. Um, I got to hang out with all the VIPs, you know, Coop, Sophie Lightning, um, PDK, uh, Legit Red, like, all, all wonderful, wonderful people. Uh, just, just great people. Um, I learned a lot about them, and you know, it's just like it's kind of humbling in a way, and it's it's great. 